Hello, Soft Strong Nation, Joe Simons, Light Diamonds. We are back again. Got my brother, Luke Simons, here. We're talking about the new Salt Strong Tackle Store. Some of you guys might have seen some changes. Some of you guys might have been saying, hey, what the heck is going on? Why do you guys have so much amazing stuff? And then other people are like, well, why, where is everything? Uh, what's happening? And so we're going to address all of that and even show you the store and really talk through the, the big why and, and why this is going to be so unique. Why our shop, I believe, could disrupt the way that Tackle is, is both sold and the way that uh, people are getting education on fishing tackle and exactly what they need. And let's just start off first with kind of the big problem, Luke. And you can hear me, right, Lukey? I hear you loud and clear. Making sure I see that big, beautiful beard there. Uh, looking more and more like Jesus. That's a, that's a compliment. Thank you, I appreciate that. That's a compliment. So the kind of the big problem as, as we see it is two guys who grew up in Florida, who have grown up fishing and, and saving money for tackle since you know we could ride bikes and go you know pull weeds and mow yards is the majority of tackle stores out there and especially the bigger they get the big box the bass pros of the world they seem to be filled with a lot of stuff i'm not going to call it crap because i'll never say fishing tackles crap but it's stuff that you just don't need some of it is, I'll say it. Some, some of it is. So I, I will, I will definitely stay behind that statement. So some of it is. Some of it is, is, is crappy. Um, and, and, and you guys know that, right? You can go into a store, especially the more experience that you have. And the more, what's funny, the more experience that you have, the more you know about simplification, right? Isn't it funny that you get a brand new angler, what's the first thing they do? They go waste their money on the mystery tackle boxes and they just start accumulating all this stuff. And I know because we did it and, and it's easy to go down that slippery slot, slope and all of a sudden you wake up one day and say, you know what? Like 90% of my fish are caught on like these three lures. Why do I have all this other stuff? And that, you know, 90% of my best days have been on, on this rod and this reel and using this specific, you know, line. Uh, it, it, so when you really think about it, you you want less tackle and you want the best stuff that truly does work. And, and that's really been part of our mission from day one is to go out there and put this stuff to the test. That's why we don't take sponsors. That's why you never have to hear us talking about something just because some sponsors giving us money or giving us free stuff. We don't play that game and we never will. So we like to go out there and take products that we believe could be good and put them to the test. Sometimes we've been shocked, both good and bad, right, Luke? Sometimes there's been stuff that we just in our mind thought was good because of a price and realized that it really wasn't that great of a product. And vice versa, we've had stuff that we thought, ah, it's only $80, $90 for a reel. It's probably not going to be that good. And we're like blown away with how reliable and durable it is. It's, it's, yeah, it's kind of like a lot of the fluorocarbon, the line tests. But, you know, that is just one example of, of actually putting some science behind it without – um, basically just disregarding the hype. Uh, I'm saving an absolute ton of money online because when the, the hyped up lines, um, namely some high-end fluorocarbons, when they're actually put to the test, like a scientific test where you test the abrasion strength, you test the knot strength, even look at it underwater, it all turns out to be just hype. It's all fluff. And it's just, a, it's, a, it's one of many um, problems in the industry that, um, that results in uh, us anglers just overspending, just spending too much because we just go with uh, when everybody we think that when everybody says something, it's true, and in reality, a lot of the loudest speakers are saying it because you know those companies are paying them to say it. So um, it's all about just transparency and, and actually putting stuff to the test. Like everything's based on actual true performance without any influence from the manufacturers themselves. Yep. And to be really, really clear, we are not against buying tackle. We invest in it heavily. We have our own tackle store. We want you to buy tackle. I got 15 rods behind me. Luke's got a whole closet I have a, worth, worth I have of a spare bedroom. Yeah, so basically let us buy it on your behalf. Let us uh, buy the, the majority of stuff, and then we'll just help you decide, okay, this stuff was garbage, and hey, here's, here's like the one or two you need. That, that's, our, that's really our, our role in this is that we test out – the, the products on your behalf so that you don't have to waste your time and your money dealing with some of the stuff that just really isn't worth it. Um, yep. so that's, that's really it. That's the, it, that's the premise of the shop. 
and we knew we were onto something, you know, prior to even having the tackle store. And we had our, you know, our insider club now uh, over 14,000 members strong. And we have a lot of these members who, who had wasted a lot of money, like we all had on tackle. And they started buying what we recommended. And they're like, holy smokes, you guys are like literally changing everything for me. I mean, how cool would it be to go into a store where you had a real guide, a real coach, you know, someone who really knows this stuff in and out is using it every day to say, you know what, you don't really need that stuff that you came in here for. You don't need that stuff that is shiny new thing that you saw in the magazine or a, a commercial about. Here's what you really need based on what you were wanting to use it for. And, and that's how we want to separate ourselves from everyone else. And when we started this new tackle store, our big promise is to only have the best stuff, the stuff that we personally know that is working, the stuff that we know is great value. And, and we're going to, we might irritate a few manufacturers that we're not even going to bring on board because we don't believe in their product for the value. Now there will, there will be some things that we might make mistakes on, right? Uh, you know, there have been brands that have been really, really strong at, at one point, like uh, let's just take Gulp for instance, you know, we use Gulp heavily and all of a sudden they went through like a bad kind of a funk, you know, where they changed up their formula and we were, had we been like sponsored by them, we would have had just like eat it up and like, yeah, they, I know they're not as good as they used to be, but I still got to promote them because they're paying us. And we went out there very publicly and said, guys, we promoted Gulp for a long time and never paid us a penny. We're not sponsored right now. They kind of stink. And, and now finally they've listened to people. They've listened to consumers they've listened to the anglers and now they're making great products again. And we're, we're recommending again, we're going to start, we're going to start having Gulp back in uh, back in our store. And so that's, what's really going to separate us is you're going to see, fewer SKUs and only have the best, only have the best stuff that you truly do need. We're going to keep it so simple because once again, ask any experienced angler, whether they're on the bass fishing side or saltwater, they're all going to say simplification is key. When you can like, just like we know, specialists make more money than generalists, right? Specialists are in more demand than just a generalist. Anytime you can specialize on specific uh, lures, specific brands, specific rods, reels, line, uh, terminal tackle, et cetera, you will become a better angler. Your confidence will skyrocket. That's why everyone, you hear, hey, what's your confidence bait? That's what we want to do. We want to give you confidence, like complete rigs, complete outfits, where you go out there and catch more fish. Uh, yeah, we, I mean, because the truth of the matter, it took me way too long to figure this out. Yeah. I spent a lot of money before I figured it out. And and the, the rule, the lesson that I learned over the years of being a total um, – uh, fishing lure and gear gadgetry overspender is that it is way more important to be an expert with say three lures like an expert where you can use it you you know how to adjust your retrieve based on what the fish are are, are doing if they're active you change your retrieve to, to get catch more more quickly if they're if it's just one of those days where they're not feeding very well you know how to just change instead of changing lure and and trying to find like the perfect magical color that just for that situation that never works out it's just better just to use the same lure and change your retrieve um, retrieve style and tempo is by far the number one thing to think about number two is the the moat is the actual size make sure it's the right size and then and then the color stuff is is not nearly as important just get a good color like it's what we like slam shady it's just a good color it's a good all-around color and then just have it, we know it works, and now we just focus on the retrieve style, the retrieve tempo, and just making sure that it's the right size. Um, just being an expert with a small amount of lures is way, way more important than being just, you know, pretty good at a little tackle store of stuff. Because you're just gonna just waste so much time just trying to, just second guessing yourself that you don't have the right lure, uh, when in reality, you just need to be second guessing yourself about the spot you're fishing or the depth coverage that you're that you're that you're in so um it's rare that it's just a, a, a lure there's not ever going to be like a magical lure that is like oh man if i only had this lure i'd be catching a ton of fish um and all the lure tests i so i still have not had a single one where the one lure catches a bunch of fish and one lure catches nothing right so it's either as long as you're in a good spot you're going to be catching some fish and that's really what the goal of our of our club's about and in the store is a compliment to it where it's just it's dedicated to inshore anglers we're targeting snook, redfish, sea trout, flounder. This store has everything you need to go out there and consistently catch slams every trip without the fluff, as Joe mentioned. Yep. And, and really, we call it the salt strong trifecta. If you guys 
for those of you in the Insider Club, you probably know this. There's, uh, you know, 14,000 of you from Texas to kind of New Jersey. And, and obviously, we have, you know, 3 million people a year that come to saltstrong.com for, for education and information. And so a lot of you might not know what the Salt Strong trifecta is. And it's number one, it starts with, with let's just say, the tackle, what we're talking about here today, right? Oh, I got a visitor. It's a little Action Jackson. What's up, buddy? You got to listen to the podcast. My, uh, my, I'm watching all three kids right now. And little... Oh, you don't know have to do with that? All right, I'll, I'll come show you just a little bit. We need to add a door lock to the store so that Joe can finally get a good door lock. Yeah, this whole COVID thing is really killing us. All right, Savannah, can you take little Jackson out and show him how to use that? Can you do that for me? Thank you, guys. And that's part number two. So part number one is product, just like what Jackson brought in. And part number two is showing you how to use that product. So I think, you know, one of the other big issues with the big box retailers is it's just a big store full of a lot of tackle. Half of it, let's just say, is kind of crap. And then let's just say the other half is good, but that still doesn't teach you how to use it. And so how cool would it be that every single time you went into a big box retailer that, you know, let's just say you're up there in the, the, the jig head aisle with, the, you know, the 500 different choices of jig head that one, you now have a guide to show you, hey, let's narrow it down to these two. And, and, and then after that, you even have a guide or even a video saying, you know what? Here's where this one's going to be the best. Here's where this one's going to be the best. And it just literally simplifies it for you. So our whole goal is one is to get you lucky charms. What? It's about to be lunchtime. You're crazy. Does Savannah's have lucky charms? All right. Well, I'll head down just a little bit. Go ask her if she can help you. Okay. All right. Go get some lucky charms downstairs. So how cool would that be to have someone literally take you by the hand like I'm having to do with my little kids here and actually show you exactly what you need and then show you how to use it. So that's right, right? We got the, the, the what, which is the tackle, then the how, which is how to use it. And then we take it a step further and show you where to go find the fish. That's really the trifecta. And then combine all of that with the community, having a network of 14,000 people, many in your backyard, that you can ask questions to. You can go to meetups. I saw there's a couple members in the Tampa area meeting up this uh, this weekend. I'm gonna go take the kayaks out. There's one recently in, in the Carolinas uh, where members are all just you know out there sharing tips, sharing tactics. Uh, that's why this thing has been so powerful. And that's what's gonna be so different about our shop page versus any other tackle store out there. It is gonna be incredibly helpful. We wanna have videos. We're gonna pull it up here in just a sec second and have videos on every single product on exactly why this is the best fit for you for that specific time. And just as importantly, hey, when this is not a good fit, right, Luke? Yeah, absolutely. I'll just pull up the store. And so the, like the jig head aisle, Joe mentioned, this is, uh, we get a lot of questions about jig heads because we, you know, we talk about a lot of soft plastics. We, we know, like, and trust soft plastics, like a soft plastic paddle tail is, is my confidence lure that Joe mentioned before. You can use it everywhere. The, any fish that that feeds on smaller bait fish will eat it. You can uh, you can use so many different retrieve patterns, and anybody of any skill level can use them uh, correctly and get and get strikes. So you have to have jig heads for that. And so instead of having the jig head aisle be like ten feet long with a million different colors, different shapes, different sizes, many of which don't even apply to like to saltwater anglers, um, we have the the select few that have proven to work extremely well consistently with a variety of different products, a variety of different, different soft plastics. And so in each one of these, there's a video that explains the specific times you should be using this, and then also the times you should not be using it, as well as um, the, you know, the, what, what weights you need, what you need to consider. Do you need to worry about the color of the eye, or do you not need to worry about the color of the eye? It goes through all those details, just to make it as simple as possible for you so that you just make smart educated decisions and let's just take that jig head in particular you know that jig head that you have if you're listening we're just talking about the z-man trout eye jig head that, that we love we use it ourselves you'll see it in many of our videos what most retailers try to do is they try to go really wide let's let's just use that jig head and they'll try to get all six colors right because it's got six different colors just for this one z-man trout eye jig head we want to have two or three 
Why? Because we know which ones work, right? This, and a lot of it's even based on science, on the color of the eye. We've done some podcasts on that. We want to keep it so simple because most retailers, they just try to go really big and wide and say, you know, I hope someone comes in here and some knucklehead just wants to buy all six of them. We, we don't want you wasting money on all six colors. You don't need all six colors of that jig head. We want to say, you know what, for where you're fishing in Texas, sir, or in South Florida, you only need this color or these two colors max. That's it. So I mean, how awesome would that be, right? To have like a guide literally say, hey, we've used this. We've seen the science behind it. We've seen the results. You only need this specific color or maybe these two colors. You do not need all five of them. And that's but, how we're continually going to separate ourselves from the big box stores that just want to throw a ton of stuff out there and hope enough uneducated people come in there and just start buying a bunch of tackle that they don't need. Once again, we want you to buy a ton of tackle. We want you to buy so much tackle, you don't even know where to store it, but we want you to buy the right stuff. We want you buying stuff that we know is going to work over and over and over again. Yeah, I mean, but these jig heads in particular, I've tested out all the different colors of the eyes and I, I still have seen zero proof that the actual color of their eye makes a noticeable difference. So in this store, we, we just literally just have the, the eyes more for us, not for the fish because it really helps. I, I now just have one color of eye for every size. Every size jig has a different color. The actual depth coverage that you're, you're doing, you know, that you're using with soft plastics is a thousand times more important than the little small color change on one little small part of the lure. So for, for just your overall um, ease of fishing with the least amount of confusion, there's yellow for one eighth ounce, there is the pearl for three sixteenths ounce, and then there's the glow for the quarter ounce. Simple as that. That's, that way, as soon as you look in your in your tackle in your little tackle tray, you just say, "Hey, I, okay, I need the pearl." You, that you, that's that's automatically three sixteenths. In fishing with somebody new, like you have a kid out, one of Joe's kids are on the boat, um, we can say, "Hey, Jackson, get the pearl one." Right? Instead of saying, "Hey, get the three sixteenths ounce one," then he has to sit there and like look at them to analyze which one's three sixteenths. Hey, just get the pearl one. Um, so again, everything's all about just making it as easy and efficient for you to go out there and catch slams every trip. But those three colors, to, to, to kind of just read a little bit, I mean, those three colors from the owner of iStrike, who is an optics engineer, he's got like a doctorate in, in optics. I mean, he has said that those three colors are outfishing the other three colors across the country. Uh, and to Luke's point, it might not be a massive difference. You're not going to catch 10 times more fish. But just even that subtle difference, for instance, we talked about on a podcast earlier about the underwater color shift. We talked about how redfish and trout in particular, uh, those two species can't see red. They're almost colorblind to it. And so you'd be better off with the chartreuse or like more of a glow or a pearl eye. So there is a little bit of science behind that as well. You guys want to see how helpful I am. I'm sitting here pouring Lucky Charms for my son. I don't know if I'm a good dad or not. But, you know, I'm doing the best I can during the middle of a podcast. Not getting flustered at all. I'm going to pour a perfect little bowl here of Lucky Charms. You love Lucky Charms? Yeah. Oh, Jackson loves Lucky Charms. Yeah, right? and, and, and as, you know, we're going to con obviously continue to grow this. So we're doing a lot of line tests so far. Power Pro has been outperforming the others. Um, so right now, just Power Pro is on there because we don't have a reason to recommend anything else. Um, but I'm testing out a bunch of different lines. And then as we get some that can compete or beat PowerPro, we're going to add it. So again, we're not just adding lines just to do it. It's all about, okay, we've done a lot of tests so far. So far, the PowerPro original is surprisingly good. And that's what's going to be featured. And then as soon as that changes, you're going to see some more lines on there. So just so you know, um, oh my gosh, they only have one line. Are they sponsored by them? No, no, we're not sponsored by them. Um, this is just so far and you, and you can, we have, we film and document all the tests. And so you can see the support for it where so far, this has been the best. Um, I, I'm, it'll likely change at some point, but so far it's, it's held true. And that goes the same thing with reels, rods, so on and so forth. The whole thing is again, all about making sure that, that you're making, um, just smart, educated decisions on your tackle without, without overspending, without buying stuff that's not totally proven. And hold on there, Luke. I'm going to get uh, rid of uh, two little kids here that are now. So the apparently the locks do work, and Jackson has now locked Savannah out, and Savannah's trying to get in. So uh, I am going to uh, mute myself real quick. Savannah, you want to wave to everybody? Yeah! 
What a fun podcast this has been. All right, I'm going to mute myself real quick, Luke. Yeah, I mean, I think we covered a lot of it. Again, um, it's, it's just really about simplification. Um, uh, just make sure that you have what you need without worrying about overspending, without second guessing yourself. In each of these, each of these individual products will show you videos on how to rig them. It'll again, as I mentioned before, it'll show you when to use them just as importantly, if not more importantly, when not to use them. And, uh, and just again, just to make sure that you're just maximizing your time in the water. We know that, that our you know, time in the water is extremely valuable um, as we get more and more responsibilities. It's not like back in high school where you can just go out there and fish all day long anytime you wanted. Um, it's really about just, okay, we well, have a few hours here, a couple hours here to go fishing. Let's make sure that we make the best of it. And, and so that's, that's our goal is to make sure that, that you, your time fishing, whether you're by yourself or have some family, friends, loved ones, your kids, um, just that it goes as, as smoothly and efficiently as possible. So you can just make some great memories that matter. Yep. And, and there's going to be a lot of, of retailers and tackle stores that do not like us. The first reason is an obvious one. We're giving 20% off to our Insider members. So we're going to be able to beat anyone on price for the same, you know, pin reels and Daiwa reels and all the, the stuff that you see here on our, on our shop page. That's number one. And, and number two is we're not a tackle store. You know, we're an insider club. We're, we're a membership. We're a club. We're a family, right? I mean, that, that's, that is our business model. Whereas the tackle store, they, ha they rely on you coming in there and spending a lot of money on stuff that you might not really need and we're the opposite we want to give you just exactly what you need teach you how to use it put you on the fish and then bring you into our family bring you into our community that is what's going to separate us from everyone else and i know we're already starting to see it a little bit that there are some retailers that i believe are a little bit scared about this model just for those obvious reasons that one we're being very helpful we're we're being education first and leading first with education on what you need and what you don't need. And two, we're obviously given an amazing deal. And uh, you know, if you're an insider member, I, I know a few of you have already spent well over a thousand dollars on stuff that you need, you save 20% on that. I mean, we're talking a couple hundred dollars you saved and that's at a minimum uh, where, where we have certain items that you can even get you know, over 20% off of. So really, really proud on that. One other thing I wanna address, hopefully I can share my screen here, Luke. Uh, if you can yes. cancel, you say hi to Luke. Yeah, and so, and, and so just those who don't know, the Insider Club, it's, not, it's only $97 a year. So as soon as you hit the $500 mark on, on tackle, which is just like a couple rods and maybe a couple of wheels, um, you're going to more than pay for your membership. So a lot, of, a lot of people do more than pay for their membership just from tackle. And obviously, they are getting all the big benefits of our weekly game plans to make sure that you're in the right spots every single week when you go fishing based on the most recent feeding trends and the upcoming weather. We break it all down for you again so that you can maximize your time on the water. Yeah. Can you guys see my screen? Can you see my screen, Luke? Sure do. So what, this is actually from my buddy, Mike, Captain Mike Goodwine. Um, and, and we're seeing lots of pictures like this. And I want to address this because a few people that maybe haven't been out in stores because of COVID don't realize that this is the typical, this is a tackle store in, in Tampa. And you can see, I mean, half of their SKUs are completely gone. You see, man, look, they're all empty there. You see that? Like everything looks like it's sold out. I mean, look at that one with uh, all the weights and some of the, the Mustad hooks. I mean, almost completely gone. Uh, Tony recently went into to the Bass Pro in Orlando to see what they look like. And, you know, normally you have that entire like wall of rods. And he's like, it was like they were all gone. It was almost like there was like three random rods sticking up. It was just like empty house. And Jackson said, who took them? That's a great question. So who took them is all of us fishermen because of COVID. The one thing they can't take away from us is fishing and boating. And so fishing licenses have been an all-time high. Fishing tackle sales have been an all-time high. The bad news is a lot of these little small parts, like let's just take hooks, for instance, are coming from Japan, from China, from South America. And because of COVID shut many of these plants down for, in some cases, months, the entire industry went through basically a perfect storm of selling more tackle than the history, probably the history of America. There's been more tackle sold in the last couple of months. And now we have fewer, fewer inventory. I mean, we have so many SKUs that like Shimano, for instance, is literally sold out at the manufacturing level, meaning all these groups, every tackle store in America could not buy many of Shimano's like spinning reels, for instance. Like, I mean, talking done, completely out. 
So this is something that's impacting everyone. Good news is, I think worldwide COVID, you know, seems to be going down. It's getting better. It's not done by any stretch of the imagination, but it's getting better. So many of these plants are operating again and opening them up. So we are seeing tackle. We put some really big orders in and you're going to start seeing, you know, everything. We have a lot of Daiwa in right now. Uh, we've got a lot of, uh, a lot of the pin reels and, uh, and, and rods and stuff coming in as well. Same with uh, Shimano. So you're going to start seeing some of the, the bigger brands that a lot of you have asked about. We just want to address it are coming in, but no, this is something that's impacting everyone. It's not just us. It's not just your tackle store down the street. It's uh, it's nationwide. You guys are impressed with how and, well. And I'm again, for, for all of them, we're, we're only getting the ones that have really proven to be um, standouts in their, in their respective um, lineup you know, in their, in their respective purpose. And, uh, and we'll again, educate you on when you need it and when you don't. And uh, just, again, just to make sure that, that you're, you're, you're matching the equipment that you have for the type of fishing that you're doing. Super, super important. Yep. And then finally, if you guys can see this, I'm holding up an empty bag of the Z-Man Minnow Z Slam Shady. Empty because I am personally out as well. I know so many of you have been asking about it. We put that order in with Z-Man in February. Talk about bad timing. We put a massive order to get all of the main uh, items we were doing with Slam Shady. And so the bad news is COVID hit after that and it went on hold and they got so far behind. It wasn't even funny. You know, they had to shut down their entire plants, et cetera. And, you know, every time someone gets a case of COVID, they have to shut down stuff and clean everything. So it just slowed down everything. The good news is, which is why I bring it up, is Z-Man even made a post on their social media. Slam Shady is coming back strong with them. Uh, we obviously own the, the rights to Slam Shady and we are doing a licensing deal with them and we are gonna have Slam Shady back in store soon. They're gonna be printing these off very, very soon. Uh, it still might be way after Labor Day for all I know with just how things keep happening, but know that it is happening, it is in the process. And the better news is we're gonna have a couple of new molds as well. So we had the three inch, uh, Minnow Z, we had the four inch diesel Minnow Z and the five inch cinnamon paddle Z, which we still have some of that in stock uh, right now. We're going to be adding a couple more Z Man molds in Slam Shady as well, and that's going to be awesome. And that will be only found in our store. At some point, you're going to be able to buy them other places. We are working with Z Man on, on some licensing stuff to be able to, to get that out there. You know, if you are in a pinch and, and don't have time, uh, even though we're shipping stuff out like next day, by the way, too, like we're trying to be as close as we can to an Amazon, we want to have an amazing customer experience. And we've got our girl, Carol, I mean, that she is on it. Uh, so if you put an order in right now, if you go to our shop page and put an order in today, it's most likely going out tomorrow morning, if, if not sometimes even same day. Uh, but you know, just know that we're trying to get everything out that next day where it's in the post office's hands, first class or priority, depending on what you're buying. And boom, it's gonna be in your hands pronto. So you can start using it and, uh, and, and putting it uh, to work. But know that we've got that coming in. Luke and I are dying to have some more as, uh, as well. Uh, of course, we have the Slam Shady 2.0 uh, in, uh, in stock right now. We did get some, uh, some, new, uh, some new baits on the Slam Shady 2.0. And guys, gals, if you got a fish that bites off the tail, keep using it. It's called the 2.0 for a reason. It's a two-in-one. I don't know if you saw that report in the insider community recently, Luke, where I, I think one of our members had an aha moment like, I just caught my personal bed re best redfish uh, on the on the Slam Shady 2.0 without the tail. You know, they had something bite it off. Like, ah, I'm just going to keep using it and I ended up catching their personal best uh, redfish. So it works like magic, like money, even without that tail. So make sure to keep using it and get twice as much uh, of, of, of hopefully fish catching from, uh, from each bait. Um, other than that, yeah, just know that we are working hard to make sure that, that we keep our shop incredibly unique, that it is gonna be super helpful, the most helpful and education first tackle store, hopefully in America is, is our goal. And that because you know we're a, we're a, we're a membership, we're a, a fishing club first and foremost, we don't have to really make money on the, on the tackle. That's the reason we're able to give you know, all of our members 20% off. We, we really wanna be education first and family first and, and community first and then second, you know, provide the, the very, very best, uh, best tackle to you guys. And uh, know that we'll probably always have a little bit different looking shop page. We're never going to have just every brand out there just to have it. Uh, because once again, we just want to give you the best. We want to give you the stuff that, 
that, that, you know, you're going to be able to look back on two, three, five years from now and say, man, I'm glad I bought this. This is, this is, this is still working for me that this has been an incredible value. Not, oh man, I, you know, I bought, you know, something that looked really shiny uh, just because it had bright colors on it. Like a lot of the retailers are doing. So we're only going to have the best. We're going to be leading with the best and the leading with education. And uh, once again, very, very soon, if not already today, when you guys see this, you'll be able to go on our shop page and every single item is our goal. You're going to have a video on there that's actually going to walk you through how to rig that item if it's if it's a soft plastic, et cetera, or how to use this to the absolute best of the, the ability to maximize every dollar you spend on that. And I, I think you're absolutely going to love it. It will be like having, you know, a full-time captain sitting over your shoulder saying, hey, what do you think about this? Oh, boom, hit play. And it's actually going to tell you everything you want to know about it when to use it, when not to use it, what's going to be the best use for it, et cetera. So anything else, Luke? Yeah. So for those who, who just don't know, so um, we made some big changes recently. It used to be on shop.saltstrong.com and, and we moved it over to fishstrong.com. So it's now it's much easier to find. Just type in fishstrong.com and it's there. And again, all members get 20% off. So if you're not a member, first go to saltstrong.com. That's our main website. You can join there. Then you'll automatically, once you once you're a member, you'll automatically have 20% off the entire store, at least 20% off the entire store. And again, everything on the store before it gets there, we have we ask ourselves, this is our our uh, our vetting process to actually add something on there. Is will this help one of our members catch more fish in a specific situation compared to everything else? Mm-hmm. And the answer is no, it doesn't get on there. So um, just know, and then obviously on the on those pages, you'll you'll see exactly what situation you you will need this and if you're not fishing the situation then, then don't buy it it's um it's really all about making sure that you don't end up doing what uh what i did and buy everything i i saw that looks somewhat uh decent and now i end up with like a whole second room full of just stuff i never even use just yeah. collecting dust so. so i want you guys to to make sure you heard that we we ask every time we're about to make a purchase our f- number one filter is, is this going to help our insider member, our customer catch more fish? Okay. Whereas every other retailer is asking, can we get some sucker to buy this? I'm just telling, I'm just being, that's what they look at. Can, can we sell this? Can we push this fast? And we're doing just the opposite. We look at it as, all right, is this going to help our, our, our best customers, our insiders, and even just our general audience, is this going to help them catch more fish? And we know if the answer is yes, that it will sell. Uh, so just know that ours is going to be completely different and we love your feedback. If you guys are finding things like we've got a couple new products that we're testing out that came from our insider members uh, that, that don't have the big marketing arms that some of these big brands have, but do work. And we're surprised by some of these things. So you, you'll even see some items that might not be top sellers in some of the, the retail stores because they don't have the marketing arms and all the salespeople, but they're really great products. So know that we're always testing stuff like that out. So if you have, Maybe it's a product that's not really well known. Maybe even a, a local uh, product. We would love to entertain that. We love testing stuff out. Uh, we're out in the water every single week, putting stuff to the test, testing new lures, testing new rods, reels, line, et cetera. So let us know. Uh, support at saltron.com is the best way to kind of comes to all of us. And uh, we would love to hear from you. Any other ideas or, or other products that, uh, that you want. And just know that some of the stuff is not on there purposely right now just because it's out. At the, at the manufacturing level, but know that uh, we are getting a lot of stuff coming in here over the next uh, next few months. So uh, that is it on, on my end. I'm going to go make sure uh, my kids are, are not eating Lucky Charms for lunch and uh, maybe have something healthy. Like, I don't know, what do you think? Peanut butter and jelly, Luke? It's a healthy... You can't go wrong with PBJs. Yeah, so even adults, you know? I mean, it's just that gift that keeps on giving all through life, PB&J. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Yeah. Any questions at all, just reach out to us. Love to hear from you. And, uh, and as I said before, we're going to be constantly testing out new stuff and we're always looking for, for new ideas to, 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 uh, just test out new lures. And for those who aren't watching, it's pretty funny because every like 10 minutes, um, some new, uh, a new young child is walking into <laughs> the background of Joe. At one point, Savannah, his, uh, his second child had a whole armful of her, like, it looks like a favorite teddy bear. She wanted to show off. <laughs> So it's been quite a treat to see uh, see all the surprises coming in. Hey, fam- family first, all, yep. always family first. Um, and then finally, too, speaking of family, join our family. If you haven't joined the Insider Club, what are you waiting on? 
I, I, it still shocks me that, that some people, they, they'll send us messages and they're literally like everything they're asking for is like inside the insider club. Well, we're going to help you save money on your tackle so you can justify it logically to say, all right, I, I know I'm probably going to spend a thousand bucks this year on a tackle. So right there, you've already saved $200. Ours is only 27 cents a day, 27 cents a day. I know most of you listen to this drink coffee. You can't even, even if you're brewing coffee at home, do the math, it comes down to way over 27 cents. I brew my coffee at home and it's like 55, 60 cents a cup when you really do the math of what it all costs with the machine and all that. So it's cheaper than a cup of coffee every day and it comes with a 100% money back guarantee for an entire year and you're gonna save money on your tackle. You're ultimately gonna save money on on every fishing trip, right? Which is our goal is we get you the right stuff and then make sure you are fishing at the right place at the right time. We talk about that 90-10. If you guys have watched that webinar, if you haven't, definitely watch it. It's all about putting you in the feeding zone. That 90% of all the feeding fish are in just 10% of any area at any given time. And every Friday, Luke's about to, uh, I believe, go on here uh, shortly and, and start looking through all the community and film exactly where you should be fishing this coming weekend. We do it every single week using online satellite maps based on all the intel that we're gathering from, you know, from our community. There's new fishing reports going up every 10 minutes and taking all that intel and putting it uh, into one 10 minute video saying, here's exactly where you want to fish based on real trends. And then finally, the network, that community. I mean, it really is, a, it's a family. It's a family to us. It's a family to the members. It's uh, there's no cursing allowed. There's no negativity. It's all just uplifting people you can ask any question you want regardless if you're brand new or if you're a weekend warrior like most of our members even full-time guides are joining one they, they love the discounts and two they just they love having the network so we'd love to have you in there you can go learn more about that at saltstrong.com and for the shop page as luke mentioned fishstrong.com we still have that shop page it just forwards over to the shop.saltstrong.com but fishstrong.com we want to make it super simple for you so fishstrong.com for tackle saltstrong.com to join the insider club and to see all of our tips and all the new things that we're doing and all the craziness going on with, with family and, and dogs pooping out slam shadies and all that great stuff that, uh, that makes us just real people trying to, trying to, to, to do some awesome stuff and awesome work in this, uh, this world and, and make a big impact through, uh, through fishing. So we can't appreciate you guys enough. If you made it this far, we love you. Uh, thank you guys so much for all the support. And if we can help you out or, or better serve you in any way, let us know. We would love to hear from you. It's support at saltstrong.com will come to both myself and Lukey. Good stuff. Yeah, appreciate your time. That's it, guys. Have a great one. We out. Peace.